I'm Sharice Nicole with Coco Fab TV. We are here on the red carpet for the official BET Awards free party hosted by the one and only Miss Deborah Lee. To have, I'm so proud of you. Proud of you. I am sitting here being envisioning when we first met at the Four Seasons. And no, it's beautiful, but you know what? That's life. That's the journey, and it's. It's humbling and just, and also inspiring at the same time to see. And I'm just so proud of you because you can talk about it. You can talk about it and dream about it and think about it. But you are here. We are interviewing just like you said you wanted to do. Well, you are such an inspiration to me. Every day that it's hard and, you know, I have to work extra, extra harder than I feel like a lot of other people do to, to get one step closer. I look at what you're doing and I say, it is going to be worth it. I know it because if Mara is doing it, I know it's possible. Oh, thank you. Thank you. And you know, it, it's, it's actually our history in this country. And we still, even though things are better, we still have to, you know, America's got to, you know, it's not completely equal, but you know what, we can't, you can't bitch about it, you just got to keep doing it. So keep knocking down that wall, so I'm proud of you. We have to talk about all of your shows, your films, everything that, oh, Mara, you are a beast. <laughs> You are a beast. Right Thank now. you. I love what I do. I love what I do. And even when I think I need a break and my mind will have a new idea. And um, I, I call it being in the rabbit hole. I like, I like being down there. It's my gift. God gave me this gift and I'm going to wear it out until I can't do it anymore. Well, thank God that you are actually following your path. A lot of people are afraid to step into their destiny because it's scary. A lot of people are afraid of that. Oh, it's still, it's still scary for me. You know, every time you want more, you got you to gotta do more. And, and sometimes you don't know if you're ready for it or um, if, you, if you can do it or if you want to do it. But um, I do. And I've got a great man by my side. As just not just, just full circle. I've got um, raising great boys. And so... We see you on Instagram, girl. We see yeah, yeah, yes. I love my Instagram. I love my Instagram. I found my, I found my voice in Instagram. Yeah. What what can we expect? Being Mary Jane, the game. I'm not the say, you know, I will say you know, part, that is my commerce is to is is the content. So I can't give it away. However, I will say thank you to the audience for being patient. Um, but I will say it's hot. Both things are hot. I was in the game writer's room, and, it, you know, I know everybody wants everybody happily ever after. We do yeah. at the end. Yeah. <laughs> at the, at the yeah. end. But you got to, it's a good triangle. Come on. Yeah. Kelly's back. We fell in love with Chardonnay. Oh, my God. Yeah, and the guy we love to hate has got two great choices. Oh, my God. Tasha got a baby. Oh, uh, Look like Jay and and um, and Kira gonna get married and what's going on with Malik's arm and he can't get it together. It's great, but the writers Kenny Smith is leading a great team of writers and it is a lot of good stuff happening there. I just was reading the outlines um, earlier today. Being Mary Jane, not gonna tell you that we're almost wrapped up with production, but I will say this: um, Mary Jane clearly was ready to move on, but oftentimes. Um, before you can move on, when you want to move on, sometimes you got to get knocked two steps back. So it's always a journey. It's always a journey. I'm Sharice Nicole. Thanks for watching Coco Fab TV. And remember to know what's good in Hollywood. You got to see Nikki.